The 1974 Turkish invasion of Cyprus has been treated as just a footnote in so many textbooks, or not even mentioned at all. Millions know little if nothing at all about it. Others ignore the present-day consequences of its existence. Creating an acknowledged educational masterpiece that will be made available to as many students around the globe is our primary objective. It's important that teachers make the study of the 1974 Turkish invasion of Cyprus and issues of hatred and intolerance as relevant as possible so that it can have more meaning and impact for every individual in their own lives. 74 centres on the lives of four women and the gross injustices perpetrated against them following the 1974 Turkish invasion of Cyprus. It's a war drama, a story of love, loss, life and death seen through the eyes of these four symbolic women, each one representing a town under Turkish occupation, Gerinya, Girne, Morfu and Varosha. These powerful figures are united by one constant that anchors and ties them all together, their hope for the island's reunification. The process so far has been a profound and emotional experience. With two international Best Screenplay awards already under its belt, 74 has garnered the interest and support from investors and sponsors who identify with our aim to create a film of commercial, historic and of course academic value. More needs to be done for bringing the consequences of the 1974 Turkish invasion of Cyprus to light. Cyprus is plagued with a lingering issue, an unrecognized Turkish Cypriot North. The Cyprus crisis that unfolded in the summer of 1974 serves as a daily reminder of a chronic 40-year-old wound. The unresolved Cyprus dispute persists to torment our island's future since it's so tied up in the politics of the past. Modern-day Cyprus remains a divided island, Nicosia is the only divided capital in the world. The film will be shot using both modern and old school filmmaking techniques to create a more documentary-like realism. The entire process will be exciting and unforgettable. We want to eliminate the aesthetic distance between the audience and experience. Movies themselves are metaphors for how humans experience life on a deeper level. Creating a unique language of metaphors and symbols for the film is a big part of being a visual storyteller. The symbolic images used extensively throughout the film will help audiences understand abstract concepts that can't always be translated into words. I want 74 to be a blockbuster, a cult classic that will be debated and discussed for decades. For me, 74 will be a redefining film. I'm delighted that it's been placed under the auspices of the First Lady of Cyprus, Mrs. Andrea Anastasiadis, and I'm certain that upon completion, 74 will be a film that will embody the soul of Cyprus. <laughs>